And welcome back, this is Bali Scuba with more Let's Play Final Fantasy V. I am joined, as always, by my lithograph hunting squad of Bart, Raina, Krill, and Ferris. When we last left off, we got three of the twelve ultimate weapons that killed Enuo. Hopefully, we can get more today. Well, probably not today, but sometime this session. Uh, what we need to do today is actually a bit of a side quest. We could have done this a little bit earlier, uh, but we would have needed the airship. What we need to do is land here, just pretty much north of the sealed castle, far south part of the map. You see this little forest right here? We need to get into a random battle into it, in it, because this leads us to the Mirage Village. There are time travelers here. Interesting. Uh, there is the inn. I don't think there's anything new here at the end for, uh, for sale at the item shop, at least. Do you have anything new? Oh, God, look at the price of elixirs. Ethers are, are pretty nice, though. You can, you can get those relatively easily. But elixirs, holy crap! Uh, nothing new with the other one. I know that for sure. Do we have anything else around here? What What's up? The town of Mirage. I gathered that. We have a pub! Pubs are always nice. Yes, you're back in the real world. Is that so hard to figure out? Ah, oh, time stands still when they're in the end zone. So, apparently, by talking to them, we've proven that they're not in there anymore. A thousand years old? Holy crap. Uh, even though he says that is a song, that is not a song that you can learn. I want to talk to the barkeep. There we go. And it was immortal, but he traded his immortality to obtain the void. That does not sound good at all. The Void is trying to return to the world. Of course it is. Of course it is. And hidden stairs in the walls of Phoenix Tower. Hooray! Secret Passage Tower. Uh, you might notice that there's a little rasp to my voice. I am a little sick. Uh, I recorded this actually after I did the uh, Dragon Age Origins session. So if you've already seen that, I've already gone over it just a bit. Need to wait for this guy to get out of my way so we can come down here and get the Thief Knife. Very nice. I don't think that's actually better for anybody, but we'll take a look. Yeah, the assassin thing. Yeah, nothing's going to compare with the assassin dagger. Not the thief knife. Not after what we've done. Um, yeah, so getting over the sickness slowly but surely. I'll give you something real good, but not for free. Let's see. First, you got to go round the world on a yellow chocobo. How's that? It sounds familiar to me. Uh, and not going to be something that I'm going to be able to do right now. I think that it actually is possible, actually, though. So I will we'll take care of that later if we do take care of that. Okay. Through this secret passage that was behind the pub, we can talk to this guy. There used to be a piano. I will find the piano. It's what I do. Also, this is going to be the first week that we... Uh, do Final Fantasy V. Oh, very nice. Then we do Final Fantasy V every day, Monday through Friday. Two merchants in every store, you say? That is definitely important. Uh, back on basement number one. Anything in here? They won't let me inside, so I, I, I guess I don't know. So, Monday through Friday. Look forward to it on Tuesday. What do you got? You are the weapon shop, the secret weapon shop. We do have some good items here. Magic shurikens, of course, more throwing items. Uh, double lance, which for some reason the lancer can't equip. Uh, moon rings, skills, very, very nice. But in the normal weapon shop, what do we have here? We have flame saver, yeah, nothing that great. Magic bow is pretty much the best thing here. Maybe the Ichimunji, uh, but of course we can find better stuff once we get more lithographs. It's not a Kiku Ichimunji, just an Ichimunji. Hold on for one second. Sorry about that. Let's move on. Yeah, still a little sick. <laughs> okay, we need to head through secret passage through here. Ignore those stairs for now through another secret passage to find the piano. I am Piano Master. We have done it. We have found all eight pianos. You don't get anything as far as I remember. But we have completed 
all eight pianos. But if we head up here, we can find ourselves a black chocobo, which actually I do want to grab. Get, get over here. Thank you. Oh, it was early. But really, I just wanted him so that I could get out of town and get back in real quickly. Uh, we will be using him later. Just remember that he is there. Okay, so we already have gone through the uh, secret weapons shop. Let's go into the magic shop and see what we can find here. We do have some of the older spells, I believe level 2, level 3, somewhere around that range. Uh, nothing that I am particularly interested in, though, because I already have those uh, in stock. If you missed those, though, you can grab them again. Let's head through the secret entrance back here into the magic shop, and here is where I'm going to be spending a lot of money. Uh, we have Arise, which does revive... Um, I believe just one party member, but to full HP. Although in this game it could be multiple party members. I think it's just one party member though here. Uh, Dispel, where it's just like any other uh, other Final Fantasy game, dispels uh, an enemy's magic or your own if you want to do that for whatever reason. Uh, Doom, pretty useless. Uh, I don't think it's instant death. I think it starts a countdown in this game. Asper, which steals MP. Quick, which I believe heals, or not heals, uh, puts haste on everybody in, in the party instead of just one person. And then we got X Zone, instant death spell. Not a big fan of instant death spells, but I will purchase all the magic just in case I should want to use them eventually. Did I talk to you? Uh, yeah, we already saw the strange bird. It's a chocobo. A black one at that. I uh, did talk to you. I saw the earth split in two. Uh, he was there for that and didn't say anything to anybody. A dragon died at Phoenix Tower and was reincarnated into a phoenix. I always thought it was supposed to just be a phoenix is a bird that just reincarnates. But what do I know about mythology? Into the armor shop we go. Here we can find crystal equipment, which is probably what I'll be spending a lot of money on. Especially since we can get weapons at the tower, at the sealed castle. Once again, I, I want to say it's a tower for one, for whatever reason. It is definitely a sealed castle. Everything else, we have mostly seen before. Costumes, that is weird to me that not everybody could wear a costume, but what do I know? Black and white robe can be worn by either one. That's interesting. So now it is time to find the secret entrance into here. If I remember right, this one was tricky. This one tricked me for a while. It's like, it's not in the back. I remember that. Maybe it's on the ground floor? Like, over here? No? This one? Hold on. Right, of course. This one is the one that is the least secret out of all of them, yet it, g it always puzzles me the most. What you need to do in order to get to this secret entrance is touch the counter. Just just ask them to open up a secret passage for you. Uh, there is another secret passage here, but it just leads to a dead end. That's as far as you can go. Uh, so if you just head up and around here, you can find another shop. Fire rings absorb flames, protect against the cold, but are weak against water. Coral rings absorb water, protect against fire, but are weak against lightning. Angel rings protect against zombie and aging spells. Angel rings sound very, very good to me. Can I talk to you? Thank you. Thanks, buddy. And here is where I will... I don't even have enough money to purchase all these things. This is where I spend a ton of money, though. Uh, you can get wing shoes, angel ring, coral ring, fire ring, mommy is tiara, angel robe, which... Nobody... Not even the white mage? Weird. Uh, wing shoes, I believe, put haste on you at all times as well. I will not be purchasing any of these just yet, uh, but whenever I say that th I have equipment... This is probably where I got these rings, just for future reference. Okay, that is actually it for the secret town here, the, the, the Mirage Town. We have unveiled all of its secrets, so it's time for me to equip some stuff, and I'll be right back. Did not end up buying too much there, didn't buy any of the accessories, but I did buy a crystal helmet 
for Bars, Crystal Mail for Reyna, Circlets for Krill and Ferris. You might notice that I have the Blood Sword and the Partisan equipped on Bart and Reyna. That is because of the first enemies that we are going to fight in our next destination, which is the next shrine. And as you remember last time, when we went into the shrine, we have to land over here in order to get to it, we had to fight gargoyles. Uh, that's going to be the same for every shrine. We have to fight the same two gargoyles here at the front. They get healed by holy elemental. Well, just anything holy. So, don't use it on them. It just, just makes sense. Just makes sense. We have to kill them both at the same time, just, just like last time. With the gargoyles out of the way, we re-equipped our ultimate weapons and are ready to move on. Now, I am probably one of the worst levels in order to take on this, this dungeon, but hopefully we can fix that soon. In an island temple protected by the wind lies the second lithograph. And I'll go over why I'm a bad level as we continue on, but let us finally go inside the island temple and through a secret passage on the right here, which does take us to a treasure chest, but first, I bet we have a new enemy. We do, it's a druid. Um, oh, snap. Uh, druids use almost exclusively level um, magic, and I, I believe I have gone over levels before, but just in case I didn't, Basically, uh, they cast something that is... Ah, down it goes. Easy enough. Should they cast something that is, like, say, level 4? I think you saw there. Level 4 quarter. 462 gil, 325 experience, and 3 ability points. Very nice. Uh, level 4 quarter. If you're, you are a level that is multiple of 4, then you'll be affected by that quarter spell. They use that up and down. They have some very strong magics, including Flare. I believe it's level 3 Flare. Uh, old, which is like level 2. They have some strong stuff. Three of them now. Yeah, and level 5 Doom, which of course kills Reyna. Hooray. However, as a result of that battle, Reyna did level up, so now she is level 31, which is perfect, because that is a prime number, of course. You know, prime number. It's not a multiple of anything except itself in one. Very nice. Uh, so, we just get sucked through vents and shot out here. What we want to do first, or what at least I want to do first, is hit the one on the right only. Then we can get sucked into the vent again. And this will change our path. You can't control it while you're being sucked around. And this leads us to a treasure chest with an elixir in it. That is good, because that is those things are very, very, very expensive. Not a big fan of how expensive those are. Uh, back to the same room. This time we want both of them shut. Or, sorry, both of them down. Uh, now we can go through another path. Which leads us to another treasure chest, which I have to go around in order to get. And of course, because I messed it up, I got into a fight along the way. Anything other than druids this time. A slonin. And we get the first strike. Very nice. Actually, I probably need to heal. Well, let's see if we can mug them. Uh, yeah, no, no point in, in trying to use magic at this point. Damn it. How d oh, I stole a katana even though I missed with the attack. I didn't think that was possible, but there you go. A shot, please. Go, Excalibur. This is this is going to make Bart's awesome from now on. It's just going to make my life easy, which is why I did it. 474 gil, 350 experience, and 3 ability points. Krill gains a job level MP plus 10. Can now be brought forward. I don't know if that's necessarily useful, but I will take any ability that you give me, game. And we get a Kotetsu out of that, so two swords. Very, very nice. Let's see if I want to change Krill's job class around here. 